Bradner, and I see uh, Mr. McMillan. We go and we sit in the mayor's office. And the mayor looks at me and he thinks I'm crazy. He said, uh, one of the things he first told me, he said, well, you are young. You know, uh, we got a lot of work to do here. And um, I, I explained our vision to the city council and to the mayor and what it was going to take. And to win a championship, it, I mean, you just don't understand. I've been doing this. I know coaches have been doing it 20 and 30 years, and they never got there. But there's only one way you win a championship. There's only one way, and that's when you've got the entire community, you've got the administration, you've got the players, you've got the coaches, you've got the community, you've got the city council, you've got the mayor. I mean, it takes so many things so many things to win a championship and and that's why we got it I mean there's so many pieces of the puzzle you can run out on a Friday night and our guys will come trotting out and you'll look over there at that other team you'll look at our team you'll say man we're in trouble but it's what we have inside and it's our crowd and it's our community and it's our commitment from the city you know it's just it's special and it takes everybody together. Chief, Chief Police listen to me fuss on the way back from Biger in his car. And I'm just raising cane at, at, at myself and, and the coach and the chief just sitting there looking at me smiling. And, and you know, having a chief of police that's so supportive and, and you know, there's just so many things that, that go to it. And I'm gonna call this guy out here and he ain't gonna like it, but I'm gonna say it. You know, Tim Cockrell, one of the finest, finest human beings I've ever been around. And it doesn't have a dog in the hunt. He don't have a son playing, you know. But he he cares about Spanish school. He cares about the school. He cares about the kids. And, and it's people like that that make this a special place. And I just want you to know how, how grateful I am. It's not about me. <laughs> All I'm trying to do, I just got to whip beating these guys and work a little harder and, and, and to fight a little, a little longer. But uh, it's those people that make this place special. Wanda taking my phone call about every other week and listening to me and being as sweet as she can be and being helpful. But it's an honor for me to be here. I love this place. I want y'all to know how much I appreciate all you guys up there.